So, just got my drywall and my uh, sheathing for the outside delivered along with my bucket of mud and a couple of corners uh, for the for some corners I got to do. And uh, we're going to move it against that wall back there. Sorry for the camera movement, but that happens. So... How's everybody doing today? I'm doing well. Thanks for asking if I be down here, Michael, on this Friday morning. We're going to be getting started. Uh, we're going to throw the drywall in the, in the outdoor sheathing. Uh, get that wall, get that taken care of. Uh, we're going to get this window covered with the covering as well today. I'd like to be able to get the front wall done, but we'll see. So. Uh, let's get started guys. Uh, I'm gonna try and move these if my thumb will stop killing me. So I'm going to go ahead and load this over here on the wall. We'll get back to the video in a minute. See y'all in a minute. Stick around. Guys, let's go ahead and put up our first piece of this uh, paneling. Had to run to Lowe's real quick and get some exterior screws. I chose to screw it instead of nail it. Giggity. Uh, I just like it better. So I am going to uh, trim all this out. I'm going to caulk it up. So we'll catch up on the next clip. I'm going to go ahead and put these up. you see the routine and how it's going to be. So stick around, guys, for the next clip. So moving right along, guys. Had a little hiccup. Uh, the BPU, the power company, turned the power off for about 15 minutes. But uh, otherwise, man, I'm really happy with what I got going on here. So let's take a look. So we got the board up. I got screws to do the job. I'll put a little uh, caulking or whatever on those. But... All these seams are going to be covered. Uh, I'm doing some stripping on it, and the whole uh, the whole bottom part, up the top. Now, well, it's all going to have a trim around it as well, and uh, we'll cut off all that plastic. We'll do some caulking, and uh, make it look good. Seal it up real good and nice and pretty, and uh, I'm really happy with how that turned out. I did have a little booger with this stud right here. Uh, with this stud, it was out this way just a hair for whatever reason, even though it was flush. But it was making this kind of sit uh, out a little bit, and it had kind of a... So I had to kind of beat that stud in really good. I had to take out a couple of screws and beat that stud back a little bit, and then it set flat. So, anyway. So it's moving right along, guys. Uh, again. <gasps> Again, I am going to put plastic up uh, in between here, uh, just for safety, in between, uh, just for a little safety from any moisture or anything. Uh, of course, I'll hang it uh, from up here uh, at the top there, 
let it hang down and make it nice. Then we'll insulate this and uh, we're good to go with that wall. So again, I gotta get power, run over to this wall whenever it's done and it'll go up and over and into the fuse box, breaker box, whatever you'd like to call it. And uh, yeah, I'm really happy how things are going. Kind of surprised, I'm scared. Uh, also, I'm probably fixing to take a little road trip uh, to a couple of counties over in, uh, into Kentucky. I found some flooring cheap that a guy has for sale. I guess it's, I don't know if he had it left over or what, but it's just enough to do this. And I'm getting a pretty good deal on it. So anyway, uh, this is another clip. Hope you enjoy and stick around for more today. Get up, get out of your rad dude to it as always. Yeah. All right, guys, we're going to measure out this front wall and get it started. Get things going. So we're cutting the studs for this front wall and uh, they're going to range uh, in different lengths so i got to do just a few at a time. And made sure to take off the three inches for the top and bottom plate, one and a half and one and a half. Made sure. <laughs> Maybe. So I'm going to continue doing this. We'll get all the studs cut and then we'll be ready for the wall, guys. Stick around. All right. So another quick little clip. We just got back. Me and my oldest son took a little road trip to Mayfield, Kentucky. Uh, found a guy on Marketplace that had some flooring. Pretty cheap, I think. So got some laminate flooring. And uh, should be enough to do this room. Uh, hopefully. Hopefully. And it even came with the padding. So uh, I don't usually tell prices on things, but I, it was two fifty. dollars So I figured that was a pretty good deal. Plus, we stopped and had some big old fat burritos. And uh, anyway, so now, whew, finally, I got to get this wall framed up that uh, I had to stop working on because I had to go and do that. So I'm going to get that done today get the outsiding put on it and that'll probably be where I stop today uh, we'll see so uh, stick around for the next clip and uh, stay awesome guys hmm? mohawk so we're gonna get this wall framed up today we're gonna get that the sheathing on the outside of it and then we'll probably call it a day today <clears throat> That's how we do it, do it, guys. We're going to get this done, and then we'll come back to another clip of standing it up. So stick around, guys. All right, guys. Now we're going to stand this wall.
Okay, at this point, I'm going to have to take a 2x4 and kind of slam against it and get it uh, nailed up. I don't know if I want to video that because it might fall down and kill me. Although that might get me some good views. Uh, we'll check back in in just a minute uh, after I make sure I got it good. So stick around, guys. All right, guys, we're about done as I can get uh, as far as attaching this wall. It took me a minute to get it into position because I always make these things super tight and that's takes a long time. It takes a long time to get it in place when you do something like that. Uh, it's a bad habit I have. Don't make things so tight. Having said that, you technically don't even need to anchor it to the floor. <laughs> so anyway, but I'm going to. I'm going to put probably about five little anchors in there, little screws, nail screws, whatever I do. I don't know. But we're going to do that uh, tomorrow because i got to go get a new concrete drill bit. And uh, so we'll do that tomorrow. But I can still go ahead and attach the sheathing to the outside. I can go ahead and get that done. So uh, let's go ahead and do that. We're going to go ahead and put the outside on. I just got to finish kind of doing what I need to do just a little bit more to this and then we'll do that. So stick around guys. All right. So I went ahead and I wanted to show you this right here that I did. I put some plastic down, made like a little threshold. Uh, and I'm, just, I'm fixing to start sheathing it on the outside and we'll be done for the day. So we'll get a couple of clips of that and then we'll get a finishing clip. Stick around, guys. Well, I thought I was recording me putting this up, but I was not. Uh, anyway, I took just a little bit off this end. Of course, it varies. Uh, the, the length varies from side to side a little bit uh, because concrete and the house and all that, you know, you got, it's things vary. So uh, I took about a half inch off of this, and that gives it some... Uh, uh, room off the ground. Uh, again, I'm going to trim this out, all of it. So I got a lot more screws to put in this one, plus I got to get these cut and in and done so uh i might get another clip right before i'm done otherwise let's get going guys i don't know what to do i'm confused let me get some water all right guys we are finally on the last panel it's about a quarter till six right here guys I'm gonna just finish screwing this piece off here giggity and uh, hope you enjoyed this day it has been a long day I've been going all day again uh, so I want to get this done get all my stuff put up and try to find something for supper and take a shower so guys like share subscribe comment all that good stuff to the body beat down that's me Michael your incredible host don't forget get up get out get red do it to it we'll see you next time on the body beat down where we'll be Doing more work. See y'all later. So one quick little shot in here before I uh, end this little clip, this little video for the day. Uh, we're inside the room, guys. 
I'm worn out. Just after 6 p.m. now. Had to get all my stuff put up. So, to put everything into perspective, that's where my desk is going against that wall. My one free weight rack is going here. My bike, my exercise bike somewhere in here. I'll move it around. Back wall here in this corner, my drums. And uh, yeah, back up to my desk. So, things are moving along. And uh, I can't believe how uh, fast I've got it going. <laughs> I mean, we're ready to rock and roll inside here. Uh, and that's it, guys. All right, once again, like, share, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff to the body beat down. That's me, Michael. Get up, get out, get rad, do it, do it, and we'll see you next time on the body beat down. Get up, get out, get around and do it, do it! <laughs>